my beautiful buddies and welcome to a video about a brand new game in development called Paralives. Now guys, the reason why this is exciting is because this is a brand new simulation game um, and we really don't have another simulation game other than The Sims so it's really exciting to see one. Um, keep in mind too that this game is still in development so things aren't like final yet and this game is an indie game which means it isn't made up by a really big um group or by like you know like a bigger company like epic games or ea or anything like that they're like an independent group of people um and yeah this game has been like funded i think through their patreon so i guess if you guys are interested you guys can go to paralives.com and join their patreon if you would like to support this project um but yeah this this is just really different and exciting because um I just kind of like been watching this slowly over the course of time and at first I was like a little bit skeptical because there has been I guess like rumors that were false about other like um, simulation games like coming out like kind of similar to The Sims or something but they were <laughs> they were like really really fake but this one seems like legit that it's actually gonna happen they have um, it already like listed on Steam and it just seems really really cool because like just look at like the color wheel and the fact that you can adjust their heights and things like that and just push and pull their body so, so like that's that's already like really really exciting and um we haven't really seen any gameplay yet unfortunately um i'm sure it will come it will come someday um but we have seen a lot of the progression of like build mode i guess in this game um and it started off being like really really cartoony like i'll try to insert some like you know like screenshots and things like that um and now it like became like so beautiful and like realistic and things like that so that is really interesting um and their people like their characters are calling them like the para folk i think so um that was a review like today um well actually when you're watching this it'll be like the day after or a few days after um like they revealed it but yeah that was a review um my thoughts of like the characters is i really really like that you can have heights in the game that's something in the simulation game we haven't seen yet um and i really really liked of course like the color wheel and things like that i'm curious to see too um on how like maybe you choose like outfits in this game more because they didn't really like show that off i'm sure it'll show like later more of that kind of thing um and like how you create your character like your para folk or whatever like that when you have a completely brand new game do you just do you build a house first and then go into dressers or is there going to be a special screen for it like that i'm kind of still wondering about as well um and kind of like how to do her facial features if it is it going to be like a push and pull system as well um but yeah the talk about the graphics of the para folk um because this game i feel like has been kind of like a little bit controversial so far because like i feel like people are already kind of um splitting it up and like comparing it a lot to the sims and some people are for it some people are not for it so um I'm just I just like wanted to just put it out there too like I love the fact that there's another game but um I think you can you can love both games like you know whether this one is a real is a hit or or not <laughs> um it looks promising I really I really do think it looks promising um I think the creator Alex Massey I think his name or something like that he's he's doing he's doing a good job with it um but you know like we don't we don't know yet we don't have a final product on our hands basically is what i'm saying um and the sims will always be the sims like we'll we'll it'll always be there and i always love that game and i don't really think you have to choose one or another i just wanted to say that um but yeah going back to the graphics and like the whole like facial thing like i wonder how that works too like if it's a push and pull system kind of the whole thing like that because it kind of like so far um what they've shown kind of looks like a mix between the sims 2 and the sims 4 as far as like the creative like 
folk, I guess, aspect. I'm like trying so hard to say not create a sim because it's not the same and it's, it's a completely different game, but it's of the same genre. Um, and yeah, I just, I think it's really interesting. As far as the graphics, I actually quite like the whole stylized cartoon kind of vibe to it. Like to me, they kind of um, remind me of a little, a tiny bit of like Fortnite characters. But the thing is, I think too, is that it might like still change over time because like this game is obviously still being made because um the the graphics for first like when they first started making the build mode looked really 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 cartoony compared to how they ended up and some people say having a mixed opinion about like how the the character doesn't really match the more realistic vibe of the whole um like you know like build live mode i guess it is now um and i think honestly i really think i like it i just think maybe it needs a, a teeny bit of a polish like maybe i would like to see maybe more clear hard lines like if they're going for the cartoony vibe um and like maybe a little bit more polish in like her skin texture otherwise i really like it i kind of like the whole like clay style of like her hair and things like that i like that it's clay but it like still has like some depth to it some actual hair depth to it i really really like um just the fact like how how she just like looks in general i just think the think the characters are gonna look really really cute um <laughs> i just really really like it i think it's different and i think it's good to have something different um and yeah i'm just really excited i'm like curious to see what you guys think as well um is this something that you guys are interested in um like watching when it comes out are you guys excited to play it someday or are you guys not not really sure you guys kind of like on the fence about it um yeah just leave your leave your comments down below too because i'm like um ultimately like want to hear like more about you guys because like i'm excited about it but i'm just kind of like sitting and watching and seeing it kind of like develop and unfold and things like that um so kind of it will see be fun to see this and as a final project but yeah um also too just leave some positivity in the comment section down below um like don't don't hate don't hate on different games and things like that just because there's and there's room to love all different kinds of games. I just thought I might have to throw that out there because I know some people already like we're already being a little negative like on Twitter <laughs> and yeah. Um, but yeah, guys, guys, thank you so much for like coming to like watching this reveal with me and things like that. I really like it. <laughs> I think it's cool. I, I like seeing like this like game kind of being developed and things like that over time. It's, it's interesting to me. So hopefully it is to you guys too. But yeah, comment, write, and subscribe. Um, we're almost to 3,000 subscribers, which is really exciting. <laughs> And I will talk to you guys soon for a video, okay? Bye, bye, bye.